zucchinis. Big plants with an even bigger harvest. Summer squash is a crop where you only need a couple of plants to feed an entire army. Provided it's grown right. Hi, I'm Jeff from the Ripe Tomato Farms and welcome to another episode of The Garden Quickie, where in two minutes or less, we tackle the most relevant growing issues of the day. And if you haven't already guessed it, today we're talking about maxing out our zucchini harvests. Yikes. I've got five ways to prevent plants like this. There's no time for nonsense, so let's dive right in. Tip number one to max out your zucchinis this year is spacing. You need to give these large plants enough space, at least 12 to 18 inches apart. And there's two main reasons for this. One, you don't want these large vigorous plants competing for water or nutrients. They'll suffer and so will your yields. And two, when the plants, specifically the foliage, is too close together, airflow is restricted and now you've just invited pests and disease. Give them space. Tip number two is to water properly. Zucchini plants that are top watered frequently will often develop shallow root systems, creating a much weaker plant that's unable to handle periods of heat and or drought. Water less often, but when you do, really give the plants a good soaking. Tip number three is nutrients. Zucchinis are large, impressive plants. Yes, a lot of their composition is water, but they're heavy, heavy feeders. Start your young zucchini plants off in a quality soil or potting mix to begin with, and then amend with a balanced liquid food soon after. And finally, top it off again with each successive round of flowering. This is also gonna help with successive harvest and keep your zucchini plants producing and producing and producing. Tip number four is pollination. Zucchini plants have both male and female flowers and can self-pollinate, but they're very, very clumsy at it. And on top of that, they often don't flower at the same time. We can help them along by simply exposing the male anthers and rubbing them on the ends of the female pistil. And who said gardening wasn't fun? And lastly, if that wasn't fun enough, the more you pick, the more you get. I know that sounds like an obvious statement, but what I mean is zucchini plants tend to produce and replace fruit as it gets harvested. And they do this at an astonishing rate. So the more you pick, the more that plant will produce. Zucchinis are picked immature, so the plant keeps getting triggered to producing more and more. Amazing. My hope for you is that by employing these five tips, you're gonna have your best zucchini year ever. My hope for me is you'll be sure to check out the next episode of the Garden Quickie. Thanks for watching guys. And hey, if Garden Quickies are your thing, be sure to click on this playlist here as we explore and solve more growing issues in two minutes or less.